Let's go. Hey everybody, welcome back to Overpowered Party. Uh, we're I'm an idiot, so uh, let's get started. Are we back in this time? <laughs> yeah. So, uh, yeah, hiccup from last time. We, uh, or I, actually, already. I didn't, uh, oh crap, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to censor that out. <laughs> but I, I already messed up, uh, cause I forgot to save. This game is from an era where the auto saving wasn't really a regular practice thing, so. <coughs> Yeah, but I got us back to where we needed to be, so that's good. We're all right. Uh, let's see here. So, uh, so yeah, if you notice a little bit of our like stats are different, stuff like that, items and whatnot. I got different things this time. I think I chose like just one more health orb <coughs> over the devil trigger. All right. But, uh, that was about it. Okay. Yeah, I didn't get to see when you had uh, did that part. Yeah, yeah, so we got a little bit more health than last time, and one less Devil Trigger thingy. Uh, that's about it. Gotcha. Yeah, so we got to collect orbs now and stuff like that, too. Dude, I freaking remember this. This is the part where I remember back then, I caught you, and I was like, I'm stuck, I don't know what to do. <laughs> Wait, really? Cause to, yeah, because I remember, like, I had to keep fighting. It was like... I, like, had to keep going through doors, because I, I know there's, like, a part where you have to go to, like, some library room or something like that. Wait, you have, you have to go to a what? I think it was, like, a... I can't remember, man. It was a Oh, a library. Yeah, library. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I know what you're talking about. Uh, I, I think that's later on, though, isn't it? How, or maybe you go back to it. I don't know. I don't yeah, remember. I don't remember what, what part it was on, but I remember the, being stuck. Yeah, th this is supposed to be the first time you run into these guys in the game, I think. But uh, because we're playing on hard mode, we saw these guys earlier already. Oh, true. Yeah. Yeah. But these are the... Oh, shit, I forgot about the... Goddamn Resident Evil camera. <laughs> I know, I was just about to say. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Uh, how I did not miss that at all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But, uh... Yeah, so <clears throat> feels good to be playing this again. Uh, yeah, we already got a couple people who watched the uh, the first episode already, uh, which is real cool. Thank you guys for that. Very very awesome. What's up? Uh, we're fortunate enough to start off in a little bit of a better, like a little bit more of a known position, only because I've been doing like my streaming stuff. But <laughs> I mean, I'm not really fucking. I'm not a goddamn celebrity or anything <laughs> it's just a couple of people who follow me on twitch are like yeah we'll watch your stuff uh but it seems like uh what's up Sorry. so i don't know if like when you're playing with virgil do you get like the the weapons from all the bosses with for him as well or no you just keep his regular weapon no he uh he starts off uh he starts off with all three of his weapons so he already has Beowulf, you see that? Uh huh. Uh, and he has uh, the uh, the Yamato, and uh, and then he has the Force Edge, which is combined with the Yamato, which basically like makes his move sets a little bit more like Dante. Oh right. So the Yamato is his like specific move set, and then Beowulf is like an altered move set right. compared to the one that like Dante has. Mm -hmm. And then. Uh, yeah, and then, and then, of course, the Force Edge is combined with the Yamato, but he plays a little bit more like Dante, so you can kind of, like, you know, style on some enemies with that. Oh, okay. That's but, good, uh, good. yeah, the, those are the only three that he, he gets in the game, though. He doesn't get anything other than that. Unfortunately. Mm. Uh, but, yeah. Cool. Yeah, I was yeah. wondering why you didn't have the nunchucks. <laughs> yeah, that's, uh... Yeah, that's that's Dante only. He's the one who gets the weapons. He's the he's the Mega Man of this game. All right. <laughs> yeah, but hmm. uh, you know something that that I never caught on to, uh, you know, when we were little, or because, uh, you know, when you're a kid, you don't really know much about a lot of games going, you know, crossing over and stuff like that. You kind of just play a game, and you're like, oh yeah, it's this game, or whatever, right? But, uh, uh, 
uh, the Devil May Cry series is made by Capcom, right? And, right. Uh, man, the one thing that I love about Capcom is they love to use their own properties, even in other games. So, mm. the uh, like, the move sets for uh, for the Beowulf uh, are actually like a lot of the moves are actually like Ryu and Ken from Street Fighter. Oh, really? Yeah. So like, uh, Rising Dragon, right? Uh. You remember that that move, like the uppercut in this game? Yeah. That's like, that's like almost like the fucking like verbatim English translation for sure. You can. Wow. Yeah. So that's why like that's why they they put that in the game because they they man they love Street Fighter man. I mean they should. Oh yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, they should. It's like you know it's one of their babies, but, uh, yeah, very very cool. So like if, you'll even see it too. Like if I. If I pull out the Beowulf here, and then I let uh -huh. Virgil do his little stance, that's Ryu oh. and Ken's stance from Street right. Fighter. And then uh, what I like about it, too, is that they even did, uh, they even did like, the subtle differences. So, like, you know how Ryu and Ken are kind of, like, almost the same character, but they have, like, different things that make them, you know, st like, different from each other, right? Yeah. Like, Ryu has, like, the bigger Hadoukens, and, and uh, Ken has the... The flame Shoryuken, right? The Shin Shoryuken, right. I think is what it's called. Well, those differences are also reflected in Dante and Virgil. Dante has basically like a Hadoken in the game. And uh, Virgil has uh, the Shin Shoryuken, which is the Shoryuken that does like two uppercuts in a row instead of just one. Uh -huh. And Dante doesn't have that. <clears throat> oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So really cool, like... You know, little things that they use with their own characters and stuff. I really, really love that about uh, Capcom. Because they do the same thing with Mega Man, too. Mega Man use, can use the Shoryuken. That's, like, canon. <laughs> mm -hmm. For the most part, it's canon. Right. And Mega, yeah, and, and Mega Man can also use the Hadoken. That's also <laughs> canon. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Or Mega Man X can. Uh, Mega Man X can use the... Uh, he can use the Shin Shoryuken, and he can use the Hadoken. Classic Mega Man can just use the Shoryuken, I think. Right. Yeah. Really, really cool stuff. But I love that kind of stuff, man. That's uh, that's the one thing. That's one of the things that kind of like sucks about uh, Western developers. Mm. Like, we do like no collabs. Like, <laughs> like, like none, and it sucks like a mm. lot. But, I mean, not that we really have a lot of iconic stuff to do collabs with in the first place, but... Right. Yeah, sucks. Yeah. Oh, man, this fucking guy. Oh, this... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I forgot what you said. Oh, so you were supposed to fall right there? Yeah, because you gotta break the you gotta break the door and then you gotta fight this stupid a hole. Oh, I think the screen froze on me. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, I was wondering what was going on. Cause I was like, hold up, I'm not able to see anything no more. Well, it's like bridge with this froze there or something. Yeah, it's uh. Is it, let me know if it uh, stays like that, and then I'll be able to bring it back up for you. But right now I'm fighting the... Remember the flying, like, centipede thing? Oh, yeah. It throws out, like, electricity. You fight him, like, in that big, long tunnel room. Ah, crap. Ah, crap. I'm fighting that a-hole. All right, let me uh, let me actually get the screen back up for you, cause. Got you. That's that's really like dumb. I hate man. I hate freaking Discord being a freaking pain in the ass, man. It's all good. I can see it now. We're back in action. Cool. Okay, so if I remember correctly, you can hit this thing on the head, and it does way more damage. Yo, yeah, heck yeah. 
Get back here. Ah, camera. This is like a little bit of a free free roam camera kind of thing right now in this place. Oh yeah. And it's not the greatest. Ooh, I hit that. Did you see that? <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh shit. That was cool. I didn't know you could do that. Ah oh, crap. He's like, okay, I got something for you now. Uh where'd he go? Right. Oh, yeah, he's doing his stupid little flying thing. Mm. <laughs> Oh, there he goes. Ha, oh, you actually thought you were going to make it through there. <laughs> he just falls oh. apart. <laughs> oh. Alright. Uh, get me these orbs. I need to buy moves. Yeah, we trying to be stylish out here. Yeah, yeah, man. You can't be stylish without all the moves. Oh, uh, this is supposed to be the room where you meet Jester for the first time. Oh, uh, yeah. Gee, we out here making A's. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there goes Agni and Rudra. Oh, man. You know how I feel about them, too. <laughs> yeah, th those are your favorite uh, devil arms in this game, yep. right? Yep. Yep, I hate fighting them, but they're my faves. Yeah, they're really good. Real cool fight. Fighting two uh, bosses. Um, does he not? Wait. What? You already know. Oh, I already got this. Yeah, that's right. What am I doing? <laughs> Okay, so I need uh, powered up version of Starfall and Stinger level two round trip. Uh, yeah, I'll hold off on that for now. Actually, you know what? I need to save up for Spiraled Swords. That's what I need to do. Yeah, but uh, these guys are man. These guys are awesome. I I like these guys a lot. Whenever they were in the, whenever you fight them in the. In the uh, you know, with Dante. Oh uh, yeah, the cussing is funny too. <laughs> They're like fighting. Yeah, <laughs> they keep talking. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, so you remember the uh, you remember the mobile title that I told you about? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. the one that's yeah, supposed to be coming out. Yeah. Uh, I, they have they have those in there. Oh, they for have real? them in there. Yeah. I, I don't know about the actual boss fight, which I assume they probably will since the weapons are there, but right. uh, I know that, uh, yeah, the weapons themselves, they're, like, in the game. Ah, uh, you guys are... Oh, I thought I was closer to him than I thought I was. <laughs> the dang screen. Oh, yeah. So this is another thing that's in the special edition that's not in the normal games. You actually get to fight Jester. Oh, for real? <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Well, that's interesting. <laughs> yeah. If you try to hit him, he just teleports until he gets tired. Does he does any damage to you? Uh, yeah, he actually has, like, attacks, but it's, like, they're not too crazy. He just oh, kind of does, you. like, this a lot. Yeah. He's kind of, like, he's quite literally, like, a joke boss, almost. Oh, God. Oh, I don't know why I thought I could knock him up in the air. Oh, that's cool. I never played the special edition one, though. This is my first time actually seeing like you being able to fight him. Yeah, he uh, he just has like a bunch of his voice lines from the, from like the the cutscenes. Yeah. And those are, those are like his voice lines in the fight. So he's like he's like he like taunts you and stuff. So yeah. He's just like 
He's just like, just is gonna spank your butt, spank you on the butt. Oh. <laughs> you know. Making that man mad. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I believe you get to fight him three times. Do you get anything so, for fighting him after the third one? Uh, I don't think so. I think you just get like a crap ton of orbs. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love him as a character. It just sucks that he's, you know, secretly fucking a hole McGee over there. Oh yeah. I I like I wish so much that he was a different character and then they kept him somehow. Also, uh, I don't know. I'm pretty sure they did this in every level, but in every uh chapter, somewhere. Somewhere like in the cutscene for the beginning of the chapter, I think, and almost in every one, oh, there's a it. number. Yeah, there's a number for the chapter that you're in. So like that was from whenever Dante like hits it, uh -huh. and like the enemy goes splattering on the wall. Uh -huh. But the blood stain that it leaves on the wall is a number five because we're in chapter five. <laughs> oh. Yeah, and I think there's I think there's, yeah yeah I think there's a hidden number for every single one. I think. Oh, is that not supposed to come back this way? I think so. And I always tried to find all of them, but I don't think I ever did. Yeah. Good, good stuff. Whoa, what the hell is that? Yeah, no, I heard that too. <laughs> uh, alright. I think it was just my mic echoing in your in your uh, your headset thing. Oh, god. Is this right here? Nope, it wasn't. I don't <laughs> have the thing yet. I should probably be paying attention to what the hell I'm getting. <laughs> yeah, you know who this guy is. <laughs> yep. like Suicide boy. Get you out of the way. Oh. Okay. Ah, should have known that. Oh, he back. Yeah, <laughs> I I forgot how um. I forgot how uh like, how unforgiving the dodges were in this one, compared to like five. Yeah. Like. Like in five, you can pretty much like dodge whenever. In this one, there's like, there's like certain frames where you can't dodge. I'm like pressing it, but he's not like going. Oh. And like, as weird as that seems, it feels familiar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, yeah. <clears throat> I think this is the thing that I got. Yeah. <clears throat> that was weird. That was kind of just like instinct that I went up there. <laughs> yeah. It's like I kind of remember the levels, but at the same time, I don't, you know? Right. <laughs> there it is. Yeah. So we can go down here. Yeah. Go over here. Uh, it's down here. Yeah. Jump pads. That's a... Uh... That's a game designer classic right there. If you haven't made a, if you haven't made a jump pad or an explosive barrel, you can't call yourself a game designer. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I do remember. I think having to go back this way though. I don't remember. I'm still trying to like remember this part. Yeah, this is where like uh, you go back and you stab the fork thingy in the thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I remember this part. Oh, you said. Mm. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> he just has Dante's animation. No, <laughs> right? <laughs> like, <laughs> well, no Virgil would do that. No. 
He definitely would not. Give me this. Uh, possessor, not fear. Okay, so this is the thing where uh, where I can walk over that that giant hole now and not fall down. They're like, yeah, good, good luck, get here. Ah. Yeah, <laughs> right after I kill these a holes. All right. Like, ah. Be nice if that door grabbed the enemy. Shoot. Yeah. Right. Like if I can like somehow use the door against him. Right. Oh wait. Give me that. There we go. Nice. There's somebody. I know there's oh. somebody else here. Yeah. Oh, it's two oh, my sound. Oh, three. Jeez. Ah. All right. Still somebody alive. Yeah, 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 oh, yeah. Oh. Where the hell are they? Oh. Well, there's that. <clears throat> Dope. <laughs> Time to go where we need to go. Mm. Yeah, I think I gotta. Do I gotta bring this down again? How would you? How do you bring it down, though? I don't. Uh... I don't think you do, actually. Actually, I think I'm supposed to go backwards. Yeah, I don't think it does come down. Oh. It's like it's just it's just up there now. Well, but yeah, I, I don't know why, I just remembered you could do that. <laughs> wow. Enemies all around me, and with a spinning kick, I missed every single one of them. <laughs> They're like, yeah, we invincible. <laughs> Sometimes I like whenever they do, like, the slow walks. Mm-hmm. Because then it's like, oh. Oh, you think you're actually going to do something? Oh, okay. Right. <laughs> then you just, like, combo the shit out of them. Right. Oh, 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 hold on. Uh, we got to go back into that room, which means I think I got to go back up this way. Okay, <gasps> Yeah. There we go, baby. So now we're all the way back up here now. Is it that green door? I don't think it was the green door, right? Mm, no. I hope it's not the green door. This is the part where like every like all these places start getting confusing. Right. <laughs> Dang. Like, what door did I go through again? <laughs> Jeez. Uh, I'm trying to think. I don't know. If which I one saw it, was. it. I wouldn't know it, but definitely not. In the I think it. Zero. I I think it was the green one. I right think there. I'm, yeah. Yeah. I think it was the green one. Let's hope. Nope. Uh, well, at least you don't have to fight anybody. <laughs> yeah, that's true. As soon as I walk in, it's just like... What's up? What's yeah. up? Yeah. Yeah, I was like, ah, fuck. I'm not even supposed to be here. Here it is. Yeah, here it is. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, you do combos yeah. on this thing. Combo, 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 overkill. Yeah. Give me that. Oh, oh, cool. Why didn't know you four already? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I must have got them whenever I, like, played a long time ago. I probably had three of them already. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, because I think that up to this point, that should be the fourth one that you find. Right. Nice. We're making progress. Oh, making, we're making progress. progress. Making bacon progress. Hmm. <laughs> oh, isn't this a secret mission? Yep, sure is. Untouchable. Defeat all enemies while taking no damage. Easy! Well, this ain't gonna be as easy as I thought it was. Oh, God! I said easy, right? Okay. <laughs> yes! Yeah, it's just, like, all loaded at the exact same time. Right. Like, nah, we easy! We easy! Ah, yeah. oh, shit! <laughs> <laughs> ah, crap. Okay. Oh, nope. 
Oh, what? Dude. <laughs> Keep getting <laughs> shot. As soon as you go uh, out there, like, what's up? Oh, I fucked it up already. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Was that all? That was the yeah. last one. Okay. I figured that was the last one. <laughs> Just had to concentrate for a second. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, we did it. We got one. Uh. All right. Uh, and we're gonna go up this thing next time on Overtime. Uh, overpower party. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching this episode of Overpowered Party. If you want to be notified when the next episode comes out, please consider subscribing to the channel. And if you want to catch me personally, you can find me over on Twitch at twitch.tv slash destroyer, where I am a virtual streamer. And if you're curious as to what that is, well, you can come find out. I stream on Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 5 o'clock p.m. HST, and I'll be looking forward to having you there. Links will be in the description for your convenience. All right, once again, thanks for watching.